What's up guys, Code103 here, and I'm back again with another tutorial. In this one, I'm here to show you how to uninstall ELS7 and install ELS8. As those of you know, ELS8 was released yesterday or last night, and uh, it brings some major improvements. Also, the one most popular one, you can now take damage with ELS on. Yes, your car is no longer indestructible which in a way is good, in a way it's bad, because now if you destroy your car during the pursuit or something, you either gotta spawn a new car, or you gotta steal someone else's car, <laughs> in a way. So, uh, yeah, let's get started. Um, first, we gotta go to your GTA directory, so we'll do that. OS, program files times 86, uh, Steam, Steam apps, Common, Rent the Photo 4, GTA 4. Or it may be different for you if you use Rockstar if you bought the game off of Microsoft and not Steam. So, first, please back up any ELS files that you must might have in here. And my mistake, I have the ELS 7 installed right now. But we're going to change that right now. So, ELS 8, I mean my mistake. So, I'm going to install ELS 7. No, actually, no. I'm just going to delete this one. Yeah, that's all I needed. Okay, there we go. Sorry. You see, that's the mistake that happens if you just drag and drop everything. You can't do that. It will merge the files and your ELS will still be merged with your ELS 8. You cannot do that. You got to uninstall ELS 7 in order to install ELS 8. But first, like I said, go to your ELS folder and back up any of these files that you might have in here. Default config, um, Valor, uh, whichever one that you might have in there. Um, you know, multiple car modders now release the ELS file with the cars, so for the lights. So um, just back them up, put them in a separate folder for a meanwhile, you know, on your desktop, somewhere where you can find it easily, or to a flash drive or whatever. But uh, yeah, so back up that, and that's the only thing we need to back up. And hold up, yeah, down here in your ELS folder, um, if you arrange some of these numbers, some of these settings here, uh, back them up as well so you can uh, go back and change them. Um, but yeah, just just back them up just in case, write them down or something. So you know, in case if you did modify them, if not, leave them as default. I did modify mine, but I know which ones I modified and I know what number I placed, so I won't do that. So, first thing we need to do is delete the ELS folder. We don't need that anymore right now. So please back up any files you have in there but we are going to delete it. Delete. All right, now we're going to delete the ELS file down here, ELS config setting and the ELS ASI. Delete. Now we're going to go to our, G our ELS V8 folder. So installation files, and here, here are all the files, the same ones we just deleted, except we did not delete script hook, desound, advanced hook, and common. Do not delete common. You really need that file for your for your GTA game to work. So all we're going to do is just drag and drop. Every single file here, we're just going to drag and drop, including the folders. So yes, replace. All right, there we go. Now, when you go to your ELS folder now, you will have the default config file and you will have a slot control file. The slot control file is pretty much the same file that was on ELS 7 as the ELS file. On the bottom of the ELS file on the ELS 7, you would see this to, to turn on the police car, to turn on ELS on the, on the vehicles, on the emergency vehicles. For example, ambulance on, FBI on, and if you some of them were off, it would come all the way down here, like police B off, police 4 off, police 3 off. You can just switch them on if you just highlight it and just type on, then save, there you go, it's on. That's one of the major changes here. Also, um, there they have been some. They did note that some vehicles might not work with ELS anymore if you if you modify the vehicle uh, setting file. I think it was. Uh, I'm not sure. Um, I did do a tutorial on how to make a non ELS vehicle into an ELS vehicle 
so in the ELS in the vehicle slot so I'm not sure if that will still work I will try it out myself and then let you guys know but uh, for now I do doubt it will work so keep that in mind um, I will mess around with this uh, some of the old tutorials still work like how to make the lights faster how to make um, the lights brighter those tutorials still work um, and yeah, I mean, that's pretty much it, guys. If I find any problems, if something does not work, I will let you guys know. I will make another tutorial, let you guys know. Um, but yeah, guys, hope you guys enjoyed this video. Like the video, subscribe if you want. Um, but yeah, look out for more tutorials to come, more videos to come, and I will see you guys next time. Bye.